Hey there, Tony with Fieldpiece here to explain how the auto zero and manual zeroing mode work on the Fieldpiece refrigerant leak detectors DRX3, DR82, and DR58. First, ensure that you power on your Fieldpiece refrigerant leak detector in fresh air to ensure that when the warm up period is complete, it has set its initial sensitivity baseline to zero refrigerant in the air. Now, that's key because the leak detector alerts when it senses higher levels of concentration than that initial baseline. The fill piece refrigerant leak detectors are operated in either auto zero or manual zeroing mode. Now manual zeroing mode more closely reflects the behavior that we would expect from a traditional leak detector. Let me show you what I mean. Here we have a leak standard that is simulating a refrigerant leak here at the tip. Now, when I, in manual mode, when I put the fill piece refrigerant leak detector up to that tip, it'll pick up the leak and alert and beep and it'll continue to alert and to beep until I pull the leak detector away from the leak and allow it to slowly clear out uh, the refrigerant that it's picking up. Now the one downside to that type of behavior is if I'm looking for a leak in a contaminated environment, for example, at the evaporator coil. When I pull off that panel, more than likely, that entire space is filled with the refrigerant gas. So when I stick in the leak detector, it'll beep and go off, but it'll beep and go off everywhere because it's just refrigerant everywhere. Now in manual mode, in order to address that issue, we have given you the ability to press the zero button to create a new sensitivity baseline, meaning that when you insert it into that contaminated space, it'll go off and it'll beep, but I can press the zero button and now I've set a new zero baseline to that amount of refrigerant and now it's searching for higher and higher levels of refrigerant, helping me hunt and pinpoint the exact location of the leak. Now on the flip side, in auto zeroing mode, the meter completely automates the baseline setting process, meaning you no longer need to press the zero button to set that new baseline to the higher concentration of refrigerant. The meter does it itself about every three seconds. Let me show you what that looks like. Now on the same leak standard, with the detector set to auto mode now, I put it up to the leak and it picks it up and it begins to alert, but then automatically will set a new baseline to that amount of refrigerant and zero itself out, meaning it'll be ready to look for higher levels of concentration to get you to the exact location of that leak. Now, if you want to ref or set the zero point back to fresh air, just pull it away from the refrigerant, let it sit in fresh air for about three seconds, and then it's ready to come back and pinpoint the exact location of that leak. To sum it up, the field piece refrigerant leak detectors in either auto zeroing or manual zeroing mode help you hunt down and pinpoint the refrigerant leak easier, faster, and better. The main difference is in auto mode, the meter automatically sets the new baselines, whereas in manual zeroing mode, you take control. So for more information, go to fieldpiece.com, follow us on social media, at Fieldpiece Products, and as always, stay tuned for more videos.